As picket up municipal workers affiliated to Sao continue to defy calls to go back to work, city officials have had to call on the red ants and private contractors to keep the city clean. We went onto the streets and spoke to residents and business owners alike about the strike. We are not happy about the strike because at the end they leave the dirty places, they, all the places dirty, the street, everything is dirty. And at the end they are threatening us that they will come inside the shop and take whatever that we are saying. So we have to close the shop as soon as we see them coming. We've got a serious problem in Bramfontein. At Konamele and Stimbent, you can even see people are throwing their stuff every day and then it's affecting business. Our business and then our customers are complaining about, about this and then uh, we don't really know what to do anymore. Every day the situation gets worse with them on strike. Uh, the rubbish keeps piling up, the smell gets worse um, and we start to lose clients because nobody wants to park here about the smell and it's right across the street from a butchery, you know. It's meat, uh, it's supposed to smell nice, it's supposed to be clean environment and you know it, it, I understand the situation where they want money and they want to get paid but everybody wants money and to go on strike and not do your job, how do, you, how do you want to get money for that? Unless the strike with the municipal workers comes to an end, it is safe to say that the city of Johannesburg could be on the verge of a health pandemic. I'm Leroy, City News.